quarter of a million dollars up for grabs tonight on Illinois Instant Riches. Here's the host of Illinois Instant Witches, Mark Goodman. security in tonight because these people seem dangerous to me. I think we're going to have ourselves some fun tonight and we got to wish our 15 audience contestants That's good right. luck tonight, you guys. Good luck. Good luck. Got a lot of family. They all got here by playing in Illinois Riches Instant Tickets. And why don't we just get right to giving away the cash. Right, you know, a week it. goes by right, and wait. I miss giving away the cash. Let's go. Let's spin the wheel and see who can catch the number one. It's going to be tonight. Contestants, grab onto your light pole. Congratulations. You, you bought an Illinois Instant Riches ticket to get here? Yes, I did. Where did you get it? Um, Elk Grove Village, where I work. Um, at a store? 7-Eleven. 7-Eleven. At 7-Eleven? How many mm -hmm. tickets did you buy? Three. Three. Mm -hmm. See, you, gotta, you, know, you increase your odds of winning when you buy a lot of tickets. Good job, Julie. Mm -hmm. Now, you have already won something. We have Blackjack Instant Tickets for you. Congratulations. Oh, thank you. Thank you. It's Blackjack, the high-rolling casino instant game where you can win up to three times and up to $3,000. Blackjack, the big deal from the Illinois Lottery. Oh, Julie, come on this way. Woo! All right, Julie, congratulations. You know, I understand that it is your mom's and your birthday tonight. Your mom's out in the audience. Yes. Yes, Happy birthday is. to both of you. Yes. I'm not going to ask any ages. Thank you. I'm not going to ask any ages. I'm just going to hope Mark. that you're going to win a lot of cash as we play force field. Are you ready to play? Yes, I Let am. me explain it to you here. Have a look at the field down in front of you, and what you see are ten equally powerful magnets, and they will all be trying to attract this swinging pendulum. Now, you can see that there are different dollar values assigned to the magnets from 1,000 down there up to $20,000. Where would they put the 20? Here it is right here, 20,000. That's a whole lot of cash. Before the show, our auditors, auditors randomly assigned uh, dollar values to those magnets. And what we will do is give you three swings of the pendulum. You get to accumulate just as much money as possible. What you need to know is this launcher can be put anywhere around the ring that you like, wherever you think is the best place to win that 20 grand. You just pull the plunger back and off you go. Are you ready to play? Yes, I am. All right, Julie, good luck. Let's see if you can win 20 grand right off the bat. Wouldn't that be a nice birthday gift? Go ahead. That would be a fine birthday present. Good luck. Screaming at it. Oh. No. 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 Congratulations. Now, uh, what we have to do here at this point is cover that $15,000 that you just won with something called a wipeout. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of your family here tonight. I hear them out there. From now on, if you land on wipeout, you will be totally wiped out. You're going to lose all of your money. So you just stay away from that. You still have two more swings to go. And look at all the money left on the board that you can win. So just take your next swing and good luck wherever you want to move it. Go right ahead, Julie. You okay? 
Oh, yes. Good. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Okay, thank I was a little worried about you for a second. <laughs> Go ahead, take your next swing. Good luck. Okay. Oh. Oh, a lot of money at stake here. Come easy go. You still have another swing to go, Julie. Come on now. You landed on wipeout. That does mean that uh, you are wiped out, but the fact is that you still have another swing to go. Now, normally, our contestants would have a decision to make on this third and final swing. Uh, you could take the money that you don't have and go home, or you could go for one more swing and try and win some cash. Now, uh, we've got to make the decision a little more interesting for you. Let's look at the highest dollar value on the board. It's $20,000. Mm -hmm. Let's multiply it times five and make it $100,000. Mm -hmm. Why don't we do that? All right. And we will take the lowest dollar value on the board. That's $1,000. We're going to cover that with a wipeout. And you know what wipeout means already. And now you've got a decision, kind of. Do you want to go on and try and win some cash, or do you want to stop now? Gee, I, I wonder I'm what your answer's going right. to be. I thought you might want to go on and try and win some money. Uh, right. Boys, There's $100,000 at stake. Let's take your third and final swing. Okay. Stay away from those wipeouts. Good luck, Julie. You can do it. You can do it. $5,000. Congratulations, Thank Julie. You. And your night is not over. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> We're going to bring you back at the end of the night. You'll have a chance to win another $100,000, okay? Thanks for playing Illinois Inspiration. Nice job on Force Round of applause, please, for Julie. Come on, Jack. we got more money to give away on Illinois Inspiration. Thank you. 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 Touchdown. New game. New game, by the way. We used to have baseball players here. They're on strike. We got rid of them. <laughs> Boom, they're gone. Now we got football players. Let's hope that they don't go on strike sometime yeah. mid-season. <laughs> Here's what's going on. We got uh, three football players, an orange, a blue, and a yellow. Mm -hmm. They're all trying to make it to the end zone, trying to get a touchdown. Over here on this board, we have duplicates of those players. And as we open windows, it will advance the player over here with the corresponding color a little bit closer towards the end zone. So, for example, if the orange player hits the end zone first, you're going to win $1,000. Not bad. That's a little bit of money. Oh, yeah, like you couldn't use 1000 Uh The blue player, $10,000 if that player hits the end zone first. That's a little better. Then there's the yellow player. Now, there's no dollar value assigned to that player yet. This is where you come in as the... Uh, the team owner. There's cards here with dollar values from $25 to $100,000 on it. I want you to pick a card. We'll assign that dollar value to the yellow player. Pick a card, please. 
Number three. Let's see what your top prize is tonight. We're gonna play for fifty thousand bucks. So the yellow player is going to be worth fifty thousand dollars. And just so you know, the one hundred thousand was hiding under number four tonight. If you would have picked four, that would have been the hundred thousand. But that's okay. Fifty thousand is still a pretty nice paycheck to walk away with. Why don't you step back there? And we're going to move our players back to the line of scrimmage, shall we? And we'll move this away, and we're getting ready to play the new game called Touchdown. Everybody ready? Myra, pick a number. Let's get you on your way to winning some pass. Number four. Let's see what you got. The orange player moving a little closer to $1,000. Seven. Number seven. Yellow. That's what you want. That's what Ten. Yellow. Myra, Myra, I want you to know you are one play away from winning fifty thousand dollars if you find that yellow card. Number one. Let's see if it's a yellow card. You're up fifty grand. Ooh. Moving downfield with the blue player. Five. Number five. A yellow card means fifty thousand dollars. Orange. Now you're one play away from that as well, $1,000. Find the yellow card, Myra, you can do it. Go ahead, pick a number. Number three. Number three. Congratulations, Myra. Come on.